Hey guys, this is Farjana. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to configure DV opt-in form with our MailChimp account. So from DV, we can easily design our opt-in form and configure it with our MailChimp account or any other email provider account in easy way. So let's dive into it and let's get started. First, I'm going to create a new page from here and name it to opt-in form and publish it now i'm going to dv builder and here i'm going to start building and taking a single column row and here i'm taking the opt-in module so here is our email opt-in module so from here we can obviously change our form style our text and background color and which fields we want here or not and even also this button style so first i am just going to email account so here is several service provider options but here i will use this mailchimp so let's try to connect with this mailchimp so i'm clicking on this add and here i have to put my account name and api key so for this i'm going to my mailchimp account so after login here we can see here is my dashboard and from here i have to go my account and extras then api keys so here is a api key already created if it's not created already you can create it from here clicking on create a api sorry create a key so from here you can create several api key so i'm just taking one from here and pasting here and here is my account name for MailChimp. Now I'm going to submit it. Yes, so here we can see our MailChimp audience list. So I have only one list, so it's showing here. If I had several lists, that also will show here. So in my mailchimp account here i just created a new account for free now i'm going to my audience and here from manage audience and view audience so here i can create only one audience as it's a free account so if we want to create more than one account then i have to upgrade it for now i want to go with this so from here i'm just clicking my list and from here we can set our sign up forms i'm going to form builder here is several options but i am going to create it from scratch so from here we need to customize this form so we need not to use this field i'm going to delete these fields I'm tapping here delete and delete it then I don't need this and I don't need address I'm also deleting it and uh, I also need not this last name I'm going to delete it so here I only need email address and we can keep first name we can change this first name to your name or just name and save it and here i i want to create a new field so if we want to create a checkbox and going to edit it here our field level privacy policy and changing this text agree with our terms and going to save it so it's okay for now now i'm going to my website and from here i'm going to field so here 
I want to keep only first name. I don't need this last name. So here is only first name and email address. And if we want to add our checkbox item, then we have to click use custom fields. So I'm just checking it on. Sorry, before that, I have to refresh it again because I did it just now. So I am going to fetch it. Okay, after refreshing my page, when I click on use custom fields, you can see our custom field from here. So I'm going to add my custom field. Here I can see our privacy policy. So here we can see our privacy policy options below this field so here is more customization options for this field so we can make it checked by default or not and even uh, when we click on this link icon here we can set our url link for example for this page we can add our privacy or terms and condition page url here so by default here we can see these icons or even here we can write any text so for example we can write here view our privacy policy page so this is bold and underlined or we can remove it for now just save it and we can make this field required or not we can make also this field Hidden. Okay, so now I'm going to save it. So our opt-in form is now connected with our MailChimp account and it will work with our account directly. And here, lastly, we can make some style changes. So when we go to background, we can change also our background color. As always, we can also change our text style input field style or button style so here i'm just focusing on this opt-in form connection with our mailchimp account so for this tutorial here is all for today if you have more questions or any confusion about this feel free to comment below and if you need any professional help related to dv you can simply go to this page and fill this form and Write down about your project in details here and submit it. This page link is given below in description box. Normally I will apply to you within next 24 hours. So keep watching and welcome to my next tutorial.